you. So, Daniel, ahead of your first home game in the Blast on Friday, just describe what it's like under the lights at the Spitfire ground in front of a, a, a full house cheering you on in a, a T20 Blast game. How much do you enjoy it? Yeah, it's really awesome playing in front of a home crowd. Uh, it's electric. The atmosphere is unbelievable. Um, very partisan crowd, which I love. So, uh, yeah, there's a lot to look forward to. And, um, yeah, this Friday, really looking forward to it. First one of the year. How does it make you feel as a player and as a Kentish man as well when you step out and you've got that partisan crowd backing you and, and willing you on? It's amazing. Um, you really want to put in extra effort for them if possible because you know how much they're supporting you and uh, how much they're backing you. And yeah, it's not an easy place to come. As I've said, opposition players don't like it. So with respect, keep that up. Um, and yeah, we always enjoy playing in front of you. And um, yeah, looking forward to it this Friday. Obviously, extra pressure on. We want to start well and make sure uh, we put on a good performance for the fans. In terms of the best wins you've had here in the Blast over the years, any that spring to mind? A few that spring to mind. I think the quarterfinal here three years ago against Warwickshire was probably the top of that. Um, first home quarterfinal that we've won in my career. Um, so that was a great win. And then, yeah, some personal games as well. Getting 100 here last year against Middlesex. Um, and, yeah, a few others trying to spring to mind. A couple of them in COVID years, so I won't count them. But, yeah, my top two were definitely that 2021 quarterfinal win and uh, last year scoring 100 in front of the home crowd, which was awesome. You're obviously on that cracking run of form when you got that 100 here. What was it, it like to... Obviously, you've had a, a fair few, you know, 60s, 70s in T20s, but to, to go all the way and get three figures, what was that like? Yeah, it was a great feeling. Um, I was in a very good run of form in that period, so no, I was extremely happy to make it count, and uh, especially in front of a home crowd. And yeah, hopefully I can have more performances like that going forward. And Somerset on Friday, a team that for a while you were very much their bogey team and, and were on that fantastic winning streak obviously in, in recent times they've, they've won the competition and, and come on strong but you must have plenty of good memories and uh, in particular I guess partnerships you and, and Joe as well have some big ones against Somerset on this ground. Yeah 100% there was a period wasn't there about six seven years where they just couldn't beat us so hopefully we can get back to that they're obviously a brilliant team now some great additions as well and uh, they've been there thereabouts every year for the past sort of three four years so um, yeah it's going to be tricky but the South group's tough. We're ready for that. And um, yeah, especially at home here at Canterbury, we back ourselves 100%.